I filmed a what kind of makeup I wear when it is hot outside and I'm actually going to be outside. Most of the time it's really hot in Florida anyway and the makeup that I usually wear is a full face but that's because I know I'm going to be inside air conditioned. This is the kind of makeup I wear when I know I'm going to be outside for a long period of time like if I'm going to a theme park or if I'm going to a baseball game or something like that so I don't like to do too much because I know that it's just going to melt right off my face and also I did have a little trouble filming this outside because the sun was not on my side. No. 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 So hopefully it came out okay and yeah. So if you guys want to see how to get this hot weather face, then just keep watching the video. Thanks guys. Bye. Oh cool. Now we have ambulances. Perfect. Okay, starting with our face, I'm going to be using an anti-shine mattifying gel. This one's from Eve Pearl, and I'm going to put this all over my T-zone to, you know, soak up the shininess. Yeah. Moving on, I'm going to use a little bit of foundation just to even out my skin tone. This is just what I'm most comfortable with. I don't really like tinted moisturizers or BB creams, but if you wanted to use something like that, go right ahead. So I'm just going to do a little bit and then I'm going to blend everything out with a damp beauty blender. So for powders, I either go with a powder foundation or a translucent powder when I'm going to be outside. Today, the translucent powder is winning, and this is just Prep and Prime from MAC. And yeah, you can't even see me putting it on because I'm such a great videographer. <laughs> Moving on to concealer, I'm just going to use Fake Up from Benefit. This is a hydrating creaseless concealer. I'm just going to mix the light and the medium colors together, and I'm also going to blend this out with a beauty blender. Now I'm going to fill in my eyebrows just a little bit, and by a little bit, I do mean a little bit. I have pretty dramatic brows anyway, but I'm just going to shape them and fill in any sparse areas. So I was checking to see if my eyelids were a little oily, and they were, so I'm just going to hit them with a little bit of translucent powder. Moving on, I'm going to use these two blushes. The first one is Pink Swoon from MAC, and the other one is Dolce Pink from Milani. So I'm just going to mix those two together to give me a nice pinky glow to my cheeks. You know the deal with the mascara. I'm gonna load on a bunch. So, first one, second one. I don't know which one this is, but I like to load on a bunch. Don't forget those lower lashes. Next, I'm gonna mix these two super pinky lipsticks together because I really like to have a bright lip when I don't have a lot of other makeup on. I don't know, it just makes me feel more sassy. So I'm just gonna mix these two pinks together. I love mixing my lipsticks because it just gives a little something extra. And lastly, you're gonna wanna set your makeup with some kind of setting spray and do not forget your blotting papers at home. So other than that, our hot weather makeup look is complete. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and until next time, I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.